In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to use the team member module. The team member module is a great way to create a little bio about a person. For example, if you had a about our team page and you wanted to show off all of your great team members, uh, the team member module will be the perfect way to do that. Um, it consolidates a photo, um, the person's name, their position, a little uh, some inf uh, little info text about them as well as their uh, social profiles. And it, it just kind of looks a little bit nicer than if you were to try to compile these with all different modules. So here we have, uh, I'm starting to create a little about our team page. Uh, I have a call to action, some stats about our team, but I want to add now the bios of our team members. Here's the build a representation of that page that I just showed you. So right above our header, I want to add a uh, a bio of our three team members. So I'm going to add a new section and then insert a uh, three one third column row. And in our first column, I'm going to select the team member module. Here it is. Name, Nick Roach, position, owner slash founder. I'm going to select an image profile image for this person, which is me, but unfortunately I don't have an image of myself here. But I'll use this one instead. You can choose the animation for the image. So as you scroll down the page, the image will load in and it's going to slide in from a direction of your choosing. I'm going to choose left to right. You can choose your text color. In this case, our team member module is going to be on top of a white background. And since I want our text to show up well, I'm going to choose to have a dark text color. Um, you can add your Facebook profile URL, Twitter URL, and Google Plus URL. Um, I'm just going to add some placeholder URLs for now. And then a little bio about who I am. There we go, a little bio about myself and why I created the company. Click save. And let's see what we have here. There we go, we can see our first team member has been added. Now I'm going to add two more. To make things easier, I'm just going to duplicate that first module and drag the duplications over to their respective locations. You can edit each of these. Add in our community manager, Mitch. Select an image for him. And save that. Can I edit this one? Kenny Singh, our lead designer. Going to choose a profile image to use for him. Click save. Now let's update and see what we have. There we go. We've added three of our team members to the top of our page. Customize their name, their position within the company, their bio text, and in this case, I just added some blank URLs for our Twitter, Facebook, Google Plus, and LinkedIn profiles. But you could add a. Uh, actual links for that, and if you don't want to include those, simply leave the fields blank. And that's how you use the team member module.